some of the first children born in the belt, and this is the fate they suffered. They were abandoned, but at least they weren't forgotten. Here. What do you think happened? Let's find out. Looks like this scientist contacted the UNN, and they sent over the Urshanabi. But they weren't able to stop the word from leaking out. So they stole the MK Core and brought it here. But then our security guard turned on his partner and shot her? Seems right. I have compiled evidence to show why this substance presents such a novel set of risks. I now truly believe we may be looking at an eschatological event. I thought I could deliver this sample to the right hands and develop an antidote, but I underestimated many things. All that matters is that I destroy the sample and pray the same will be done to the rest of this cursed substance. The MK Core isn't a treasure. It's a weapon. What kind of weapon? I don't know. Something alive. And dangerous. Guess they stashed it before they had their fight. It's not in here. So the MK Core is some kind of organism? I don't know. And neither do the scientists studying it. And yet this company is pouring endless amounts of money into it. They're willing to kill to keep it secret, and now they're running human tests. Not humans. Veltas. Veltas who were lied to, or tricked into agreeing to this, assuming they were given a choice at all. Yes. They found a weapon they didn't understand, and they brought it out here to play with. That's horrible. It's nothing new. Just like Anderson Station, the Le Guin. Even these people, left out here to die. Just another chapter in the story. Got something. Ready? We found it. And now we're going to destroy it.
We'll reach full burn in about a minute. What are you going to tell the others? That the people with the money to buy this are the same people who will use it against the belt. Unless we don't sell it. Hear me out. Whatever this is, it could still be everything you need to help the belt. What if we kept it? As a weapon? Or as a bargaining chip? Call it what you want, but no one would mess with the OPA if they knew- The OPA doesn't work that way. It's a hundred factions with a thousand goals. The OPA would tear itself apart over something like this. Why are you so sure of that? You're talking like an inner. I'm talking like someone who knows the OPA. Who knows men like Doss and what they do to stay in power. But the belt may never get a chance like this again. You can't just take that away. You don't get it. You may have bounced around in Zero G for a while, but you don't understand the belt. Hey! What don't I understand? Belters always look for danger. Broken air filters, leaky reactors, anything that could mean danger. And this... is a disaster waiting to happen. Think about it. Not like a Martian, but like a Belter. From everything you've seen out here so far. How do you think this really ends for us? You're right. Let's do what we have to do. See, Baratna? Told you, we couldn't trust her. Hand it over. Now! And that? Arlen, listen to me. That is a dangerous weapon. It's already being used by inners against the belt. That's why I'm gonna sell it to a belter, Sasuke. We're headed back to Ceres now. Damn it, Arlen, you don't understand what you're doing. You always think you know better than everyone else. That's how you always end up here, yeah? I don't know what the f your plan is, but you can't just take over the ship and throw Drummer in the brig. No brig. Airlock. What do you mean? I just got to head back to Ceres and- Tinsha! How long is the trip to Ceres? Huh? Two weeks? Three? You want to stay awake the whole time? Until we sell this thing, she'll be trying to take her back. Stubba or voila. Never knows when she's lost. Oh my god. No, there has to be another way. As long as she's on board, it's still her ship. You think Maya and Virgil will take orders from us while she's around? Even the pilot likes her. No. It's the only way to finish this. Take her to the airlock.
I'm sorry, Cap. For real. I wish I could stop Arlen. You can. Help me take him down. But Ratna's the only reason I'm alive. The only reason I got off Vesta. You hurt him, but I won't watch you die either. No! You want to follow your precious captain so much? <laughs> Fine! Let me go! What did you do? Sabaka nearly bit my ear off. Would have clawed my eyes out next. Wait, she isn't a part of this. Put it on. We can make it to the station and send a distress signal. Hurry. I'm the one with the bullet in me. You take it. You'll be fine. We both will. I can't. Stop. I'm still your captain. Do it. Now. I said I would do anything to help the belt. And nobody can do more for the belt than you. Ha, 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 ha. 